to a carbon-rich lakes and oceans, and possibly life. Right now, Titan remains unexplored, but a NASA mission will change all that. The spacecraft Cassini blasted off from Earth in 1997. When it reaches Titan, a probe will descend into the atmosphere at nearly four miles a second. Titan is about half the size of Earth, but its atmosphere is four times as dense, and the temperature is a distinctly chilly minus 290 degrees Fahrenheit. If the probe survives its landing, it will radio its data some 700 million miles across space back to Earth. Scientists think that Titan could be rich in organic chemicals that would have been common on primitive Earth when our own life began. Maybe that means there are microbes here, too. An even more inhospitable world for life is Europa, one of Jupiter's moons. At first glance, it looks like a dead, frozen landscape. The entire surface is concealed by a layer of ice. But a closer look reveals something amazing. Photographs taken by the Galileo probe revealed multiple crisscrossing lines covering this icy world. There's only one other place in the solar system with similar features. The frozen Arctic seas on Earth, where the ice floats on water and is constantly moving. That makes scientists believe there is a chance that underneath the icy surface of Europa could be a vast liquid ocean. But what's keeping the ocean from freezing totally? It could be kept liquid by the huge forces on the moon. Europa is being pulled in different directions by the gravitational forces of Jupiter and the other moons around the planet. These tidal forces heat up the moon's core, enough to keep the ocean around it liquid. Eventually, NASA hopes to probe even further into Europa's mysteries. One idea is to send an orbiter that would scan the surface to confirm whether there is indeed an ocean below the ice. Once an orbiter locates a thin spot in the ice, it may be able to send down a robotic probe looking for life in the water below. Hydrobot could then send back digital pictures as it scours the ocean. It may find hot spots on the ocean floor, called hydrothermal vents. These cracks in the ground spout warm, nutrient-rich water. On Earth, these vents are home to many simple life forms. Perhaps the Hydrobot could find Europa as fertile as our ocean floor. Might our nearest aliens be living here? But the best candidate for past or present life in our solar system is Mars.